this Ross just a quick note just before you watch the video that I just made in the garden just down there about two or three hours ago I do say uh, the peppers that I planted last week they're not actually peppers they're cucumbers so just bear that in mind when you watch it right here's the video hi guys it's Ross just a quick gardening video from uh, from my shed uh, just sort of haven't made a gardening video in about a week see what's happening um believe it or not these are the peppers that we started off last week I mean it's the same length as my index finger so and I only started them off last week there's four of them the aubergines haven't came up yet uh, these are the tomatoes we planted exactly a month ago today 25th of February we planted them um, they're, they're going quite well We've got some in here that I didn't take out and transplant still, but uh, I don't know if I'm going to save them. I might save one just because two of those died, but that's where I forgot to water them. I left them in the shed and forgot to water them, but now all my stuff's in here. I should remember to water them. Um, just one slight problem I'm having are these. Now what they should be is lettuces, but I don't know if you can see it or not, but they are just sort of laying down and they seem to be quite tall, they're a similar sort of length. Um, to me they don't look much like a lettuce, they're probably about two inches long and they're just sort of thin and weedy things. Um, but yeah, like I said, they don't look much like lettuces. There were 32 in here, but I plucked it down to one. I plucked it down to nine. But uh, how many lettuces am I supposed to be growing anyway? Eight. So I haven't left much much space for dying, to be honest. I completely forgot about that. But yeah. So those are lettuces. But if you know about them, or no, they, I don't think they need to grow up or anything, but like I said, they don't look much like lettuce to me. <laughs> but anyway, um, so I'll just head outside and show you the stuff that is outside. So we'll catch you in a second. So the rest of the stuff, uh, I've moved it from the decking to here, just because it makes life a lot simpler. Um, I've got growing better in this black bag it seems to be than here but um, I suppose the uh, proof of being the pudding as they say when it comes up um, seeing what actually grows from it um, I've got two coming up here but then I've got these too and these look kind of like potatoes but um, I think they're just a weed so I might pull them out I won't pull them out yet just if anyone knows about them um, Oregano, nothing seems to be happening really, and the chamomile, still nothing seems to be happening. In fact, it looks like it's uh, starting to die again. Let's sort of push it in. But yeah, I might move that in tonight into the shed to, because uh, it might be getting a bit cold. No potatoes aren't too bad with the cold, but I might move the oregano in. Because uh, I did say the last frosts are gone. It has been quite chilly the last couple of nights, so I'll just move them over now. Just put them down there. Surprisingly warm in that shed, actually. Um, it's quite chilly out here, but as soon as you get in there, you can take your jacket off almost. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. One thing I forgot to mention, whoops, uh, one thing I forgot to mention is uh, I've now got my timetables and my seed charts in here, and I'm probably going to put my seeds in here too. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, and see you later. Bye.